themselves fast food workers, janitors, and hospital workers who all say $15 is a wage people can actually live off of. It will help me for sure with the cost of living. Like it'll be, um, it'll help me better with uh, finding somewhere to stay, getting me a car, getting on my feet. On the 50th anniversary of the historic Memphis sanitation strike, Metro Detroit fast food workers say they are planning to continue the fight for higher wages and union rights, just as Martin Luther King Jr. led an effort decades ago. Tomorrow, protests around the country will also be held in Memphis, Cleveland, Chicago, Houston, Milwaukee, Des Moines, and more. Hey! Similar to a scene like this, tomorrow's protests will also be a show of solidarity for cooks and cashiers in the Mid-South, striking for a $15 wage. Faith and community leaders from Detroit are among those supporting this effort. That's already won raises for 22 million Americans, including 10 million on a path to a $15 wage, according to organizers. But I have a lot of family, like a big family. They probably won't be able to um, take care of their family as well. Like if they... Um, if they was only making like eight dollars or nine dollars an hour. Tomorrow's event starts at 12.15 p.m. at West Grand Boulevard and Rosa Parks at the MLK Junior Memorial Park. It will end here at this nearby McDonald's. Expect to see community organizers and also uh, some government leaders out here as well. Live in the News Center area, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News.